Hello everyone, welcome to Lazy Creek Homestead. I'm Nicole and in today's video we're back in the kitchen. We're going to share a Sunday supper. We would make a great holiday meal. We had did some homemade stuff and a few quick easy convenience items and a great recipe for uh, green bean casserole if you enjoy. You could also find lots of our recipes at our website at www.lazycreek.com the lazy creek homestead.com and we also share a version of a uh, ham and potato soup we use sweet potatoes and then we use the leftover ham and it's a great way to use up your leftovers so i hope you enjoy Hello and welcome back to my kitchen. We're going to make some green bean casserole. I'm going to use cream of mushroom with roasted garlic. I have two cans in this bowl. And half a can of milk. I'm going to stir that all together with a little bit of Worcestershire sauce. And I'm going to spray my baking dish with some cooking spray and we're going to add in some frozen green beans and top with french fried onions. Next is some mashed potatoes. I like to cut my potatoes pretty small so they boil faster. Then I like to add butter to the bottom of my pan, a little bit of milk, some seasonings, and that's the best mashed potatoes in my opinion. And for another side, we're going to have this sourdough stuffing mix. It was easy and delicious. Alright, and the ham is out of the oven and ready to be cut up, and we're going to serve some plates. This is a perfect family dinner, wonderful holiday meal. Thank you so much for joining us, and I hope you guys enjoy. You can find a lot of these recipes on our blog, thelazycreekhomestead.com.
All right, so the first thing we do with the ham and potato soup is we're gonna cut up some bacon. Also gonna chop up one onion and we're gonna add that to our warm pan and we're gonna let our bacon render and our onion cook. We're also gonna chop up some sweet potatoes and we're going to add a package of hot Italian sausage. I also add goat cheese, you can see a log there in the corner, and a package of cream cheese that I forgot to show pictures of. We're gonna chop up our leftover ham. Those onions and bacon are cooking nicely now, so we are gonna add our pound of hot Italian sausage and get that browned up. I then added two quarts of homemade chicken stock and about a half a quart of half and half. We've also added in our sweet potatoes and cream cheese and goat cheese and we're gonna let this simmer. And we're gonna cut up our ham and shred it up a block of cheddar cheese. And we're gonna add that into the mix after it starts to heat up a little bit. Give that a stir. So the cheese can get all nice and melty and then we're going to add in our spices. And we're going to put in my favorite spices, garlic powder to taste. We're also going to add some Italian seasoning and black pepper. Give all that a good stir to incorporate the ingredients and we're going to let this come to a boil and then we're going to add our thickener. is amazing and the addition to of the rest of the green bean casserole was just put it right on the top we did thicken it with xanthan gum but feel free to use whatever thickener you like and i hope you enjoy you try out these recipes give this a like and a share and until i see you next time happy homesteading your way